Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So we had a really weird morning. Nobody woke up until 10 to nine. I was the first person awake and the whole house was silent, even the babies. That is literally unheard of. And while it was lovely, it did mean we had to dash about um, to get ready for all of the various things we do on a Saturday morning. So we usually have like tennis, swimming and a ballet lesson, but we made it so it was all good. It is now 10 to three and we have just driven down to meet up with Auntie Poppy and Uncle Dean, that's dad's sister. And we've come to play with their dog Rocky. We've just come to a doggy park. So we are going to be playing with Rocky and all of the other dogs that are down here. So we are definitely going to get our doggy fix today. Super excited. I have also booked a table at Toby Carvery, which is near to here. We used to have one in our town, but it got closed down quite a while ago. And I've been dying to go there because I've seen so many people posting amazing pictures of their vegan options. So we are going to get to try that out too. Everyone is already over on the field. I'm just going to grab my coat and go join them. Hello, Rocky. Hello. Hello, Rocky. Hello. Hi, guys. We are at the doggy park. There is so many dogs here. There's a husky, and huskies are my favourite dog, guys. They are adorable. And there are there is no not yeah there is a Labrador actually. There's a white Labrador. It's like a baby, so it's only like I think it's only like 16 weeks old. It's adorable. And there's also a poodle here. She's there. She's so cute. All of them are so adorable. So I'm having such a good time here, guys. All of the animals are so cute. Oh look, Max is with the poodle. And the husky. Jude's a doggy. He's playing with the dogs, isn't he? He's quite good. He's chasing them. He is chasing them. Getting hot now, Jude. Mum, look at you. I know. I love it. Hello. It's Rocky's friend. They're just running away all the time. You have made so many friends here today. <laughs> You're so social. You've gone up to every single person and made friends and made friends with their dogs. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. It's lovely. Do you like talking to people? Yeah. Yeah, you're so friendly. Everyone loves you. Everyone has said to me, oh, he's such a lovely boy. They think you're amazing. Because you are, of course. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Yay. Very good. Well done. Love. Iris, can you cartwheel? Yeah, cartwheel. Ready? Oh, <laughs> well done. That's called a forwards roll. <laughs> What's the matter? I want a buggy. Your buggy's in the car and the car is over there. Okay? We're going in a minute. We're going to go and have some dinner. I want a buggy. <laughs> Why don't you come sit down? Do you want to come sit down? Do you want to come and sit down? I want to sit down on my buggy. Oh, I live. Rocky. Rocky. <laughs> Jude, Jude, why are you laying on the floor? Rocky. Bye bye. So guys, we have just left the dog park and it was amazing. I saw my favourite type of dog there, which is a husky, and he was so beautiful. His name was Neo and he was just so fluffy and thick, wasn't yeah, he, Elsie? He, was so he was lovely, I loved him so much. So now we're just gonna get something to eat, guys, and I'm so hungry. I've just running around with the dogs for so long, like chasing them, trying to get the ball off of them. But yeah, we'll see you in a bit. Look at the Christmas tree. Do you like it? It's pretty. Yeah. Who is that? The Grinch. The Grinch. Oh, you can put your Christmas table. Looks a bit scary, doesn't he? Have I ever seen the Grinch? I don't know. Have you seen the Grinch, Iris? I, um, I don't know. Oh, it's definitely one you have to watch. So here is Olive's dinner. But Daddy asked for some red sauce and she's literally eating it. It's like, I can't even watch this, guys. It's making me feel sick. And like, who gives that much red sauce anyway when you ask for a like, oh, can I have a bit of red sauce? Like, look how much we got. I'm gonna have to take it away, I can't bear it. Ollie, you can't eat a bowl of red sauce. 
How about dipping a potato in a red sauce? Yeah. No. I'll accept that. Red, potato in red sauce, like a chip. No. <laughs> How about a green bean in red sauce? No. Look, one of these. No. <laughs> <laughs> What are we going to do with her? No. Uh, excuse me. We don't eat a bowl of red sauce, Ollie. Hi. Hi. Here's mine. Oh, it's so nice. It looks amazing, doesn't it? Yeah. The gravy was nearly all gone there, so only got I one know, skin. there's not that much gravy in there. All the other gravies fill up, like the beef gravy. I know, me and Elsie took me and Elsie ages to get all the gravy. Yeah, can't wait to eat. Oh, it looks amazing. It took a while, but we all now have our food and it looks absolutely delicious. Um, me, Jude, and Dad all got the mushroom and alpine. Do you like it, Jude? Yeah? <laughs> Look at Jude's face. It looks like a train wreck. <laughs> Here's mine, looking all neat, but I am going to start eating now. You all right, I? Yeah, you enjoying your food? Yeah? Where the guy? Um, apparently they've gone to see if they can get a toy out of a machine. Can I get one? Uh, I don't think, they haven't got any money. I don't know how they, they think they're gonna get a toy out of a machine. It's such a rip What is it? You put it in. Uh, what did you put money in? Yeah. Yeah. And it closes on the toy because it's really yeah, tight. Yeah. Like, yeah. It comes up and then it loosens. Yeah. And, and then it drops it. And then, then drops it yeah. as it's moving. It's completely fake, don't you think? Yeah. It makes you think that. How how can it loosen <laughs> if it's like got it? It was so tight. It was up there. And it was like all the way there. And when it was halfway there, it dropped. It. I know. You're like, yeah, yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it. And then and then it drops it. It's really bad. I think we should complain. <laughs> oh, go get one. Iris, the machine, it doesn't work properly. It tricks you, it's scheming, it's the most corrupt machine that's ever been on planet Earth, okay? Can I quickly go and see with the guys? Um, I'll ask them. Um, Jean, will you go and take her to look at the corrupt machine? Okay. The cheating, low-down, low-life machine. <laughs> Good luck. Where are you going? They're going, she wants to go and see the machine. Oh, we've got 30p or 50p, so... I haven't, my, my wallet can't open, can it? Why? I don't know, the zip's broken, I need a new wallet. Hint, hint, birthday. There's a birthday coming up in four days. Oh, I'm excited. Who's making me a cake then? I don't know. What cake do you want? Uh, red no. The last time you guys tried to make me a red velvet cake, it was like... It's like a rubber tire. Sorry, no offense. Oh, okay. No offense. It's probably the best bet, isn't it? It's the easiest. We stopped Olive from eating the ketchup, but we had to replace it with a phone. Otherwise, none of us were going to be able to eat, unfortunately. Yeah. What are you trying to get? Try and get that dog with the big eyes. It keeps Let's see. Oh, right. Come on. Yes. Yes. Yeah, no, 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 no. That is so bad, isn't it? It had it. It had it. It had it. It had it. I can't believe that. It actually had it. And then when it comes up, it just lets go. That is so bad. And it went out, then it just let it go. And then it went away. And it said, sorry, you didn't get it. Oh, it makes you want to try again, doesn't it? It makes you think, oh, I can get it, I can get it. We're going again. Which one are you going for, Max? The same one. Oh, it's not going to grab it. <gasps> are you going to keep going for the same one? Are you going to keep going for the same one? We're going to win this thing for you. We have two ones. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Oh, I don't know. No. Jude. Iris, do you want to go? Put her hands over it and then like you can guide it for her. Oh, do you want to click the button? You click the button, but Jude will tell you. Give me, give me some money. That's not. Do you want to try and do you reckon it's worth trying that Paw Patrol one? No, I don't think so. Can I get that dog? Are we going for it? Yeah. Alright. Right. Click it. Right, come on. See, look, he latches onto it. He's got it, he's got it. It's gonna go, it's gonna go. It opens up, it opens up. I can't cope with how much of a cheat this is. I really can't cope with it. Iris, what happened? 
How did you lose it? You not you just failed. The thing is, you know what? The amount of money you spend on trying to win it, you can go buy one of these teddies. Don't you think? You literally can. You can go buy one. How much did you put in? Oh it didn't go it didn't register. You know what, when I was younger, my mum and dad would take me on holiday to like uh, holiday parks, I'd spend all my money in the arcades yeah, and on machines I, like this. I remember all my money, when we literally. Went to no, when we went to Sammy the Seahorse. Yeah, Sammy the Seahorse. We won loads. Machines yeah. actually Well, yeah, at holiday parks, they probably let you win a bit more to encourage you to spend more. When you said Derby, it lets go straight away. I know. I know. Yeah. Complete Max, cheat. Like, Max, like, you used five pounds in it. Exactly. And, and we could, and they, they you haven't five used five pounds, have you? No, we, 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 we. Who gave you all the money? Dad. Dad. Oh, did he? Lucky. Iris, what do you think of this machine? Do you think it's fair or cheating? Cheating. Definitely. Dude is taller than me. It's official. Yeah. Or it might just be your hair. <laughs> What's the matter, Iris? I want to do it. You wanted to win, I know, I'm so sorry. That's why I don't play these machines, because they make me so sad and upset, because I want to win. And then you spend lots of money on it, and then you waste all your money, don't you? Mama, Learn something from this, mommy, yeah? I want to go to the machine, I want to go to the machine. But do you know what, Iris? All of these machines, when you try to win something, they're not fair. The best thing to do is save up all your pennies and go and buy a teddy, okay? What, Mama? I want a machine. I know, but they make machines like this to cheat you, Why? unfortunately, so they can make money. So guys, we just got home and the journey home was not very good. So, the first thing that was wrong was I was sitting in the middle and when I sit in the middle I feel so sick. And I was watching mum's phone because she was screaming saying she wanted to watch something, uh, which made me sick. So, like, when I see any device, someone's on it, like, I just feel so sick. Or if I'm on it. So, I like, once I went on my iPad in the car, and I felt so sick afterwards. So, I don't like that. And Dad's driving, guys. I do not like my dad's driving. He's, like, doosh, 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 going all over the place. And it's feel really car sick. So, I was literally sitting there, like, when are we going to be home? And Dad was, like, 20 minutes left. And it literally took ages. On the journey there... It felt like it was 10 minutes, and on the journey back, it felt like it was two hours. It was like so long, guys, and horrible. So, we've just gone in the house now, and it's really cold in this house, guys. It's literally freezing, like, it's, but like, it's obviously warmer than outside, because outside it's really, really cold. Um, but anyway, I'm just going to get changed into my pyjamas. I've got this frozen top. I love it. I've had it for, like, really, really long, guys, as well. And I'm also going to get changed into these blue star trousers obviously they don't really match my frozen top but i still really love them because they're both really comfortable so yeah i'm just gonna get changed and then chill out guys because we've been really like we've just been doing stuff all day so first we went on a doggy walk and then we went to a restaurant and ate and then we had to sit in the car with screaming babies so yeah the day's been good apart from the screaming babies so yeah, I'm just gonna get dressed, then chill out, guys. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna watch a movie, and then no, I don't wanna watch a movie. So anyway, guys, um, yeah, I don't know what to say. Um, there's nothing else to say. Bye. So we are home now, guys, and I am upstairs with Iris, just about to read her her current favourite bedtime story. Tell everyone what it's called. The Tea Fairy. Yeah, show them the book. It is really good, guys. One of you guys um, actually recommended it for us. Um, it's perfect for children who have loose teeth or have recently lost a tooth or are about to lose a tooth it's really really good olive and iris are I literally obsessed aren't you yeah i love it i've read it every single night since we've had it sometimes twice a night so i definitely recommend it thank you to the person that suggested it um yeah then you're going to go off to bed aren't you yeah yeah we have a super exciting day tomorrow don't we yeah because we're we? going to do don't say. She nearly let it slip, didn't she? Don't say. 
if you want to know what we're doing tomorrow be sure to tune in tomorrow um the only clue i'm going to give you well it's not even a clue really but we are doing something christmasy tomorrow and we're super excited we have to be up really early um and it involves traveling to london so yeah we're all super excited iris is coming along too because you're big girl now yeah. aren't you olive won't be coming um but she'll be staying with my mum so we're super excited about that we really hope you enjoyed like coming along on an average sort of saturday family day um with us we obviously enjoyed sharing all with you um really enjoyed my toby carvery um but if i'm absolutely honest with you I am a home girl. I prefer home cooking to eating out any day of the week. Let me know if you're the same. What would you prefer to do? Eat at home, like home cooking, or go out to eat? Obviously, I like a really good restaurant now and again, but my heart and soul is at home. I like my own cooking, and I like, like my family's cooking. Um, anyway, thank you so much for watching another one of our vlogs. Don't forget, tune in tomorrow, guys, because we're going to be having a super exciting day. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.